Okay, so this video is about using this tool, okay? This is called a center punch, okay? There's another tool very much like this called a dot punch, uh, which is a little bit smaller, but effectively they both uh, perform the same job, okay? Now, what this is, it has a hardened steel point here, and what it does is it creates a small mark in uh, metals, so when I go to drill the metal, it means that the drill will sit nicely into that space and it won't move around, because metals are often a bit harder than uh, sort of plastics and woods, and the drill can sometimes Sometimes skate around the surface which will actually position uh, the hole in the wrong place okay now it's a very simple tool to use okay but first of all I'm just deciding where I'm actually going to drill my hole okay so in this case I'm going to drill somewhere up here so I'd probably mark the um, the surface with um, maybe a permanent pen or even using a scriber or something if I'm not worried about the surface condition to give me a place uh, where I'm going to position it but I'm just going to place this on manually for the moment like this okay now it's obviously important when we're holding this to try and hold it at 90 degrees to the actual surface that we're um, uh, gonna create the uh, the point okay and also you can see I've put some paper down on the table okay because if I'm gonna strike this and there's any sort of loose pieces of metal or hard materials underneath it's gonna damage the actual surface which I don't want to do okay so I simply place the uh, the center punch on I'm just supporting it near the bottom okay and holding it quite firmly and trying to hold this at 90 degrees and I'm going to use the ball peen hammer here, okay, to create the uh, things. I'm holding the hammer at the bottom, which gives me the most leverage. And I'm just going to strike it once onto the surface like this. And as you can see, it's just made a very small indentation on the surface there. And that will just make sure that the drill sits in that position and doesn't move around. You can see it's gripping into that hole right now.